Good morning, people. Oh my gosh, there's something on the lens. Alright, so, it's super early in the morning, 6 a.m. here. We're about to go on another hike. The last video was a hike, <laughs> assuming I actually edit this in chronological order. Today, we are hiking Oyster Dome Trailhead Trail, whatever. Um, it is up over in the kind of Bellingham-ish area in Washington, so a couple hours north of Seattle. Should be super easy, a lot easier, or not super easy, but a lot easier than the last hike we did at Colchuk. So, super excited for that. Just getting ready right now, my hair is a mess. But we are going to be using a, for the first time, uh, a gig car share. So in Seattle, there used to be uh, BMW and Mercedes used to have these car sharing services. So if you're familiar with the like scooters or bikes, like free floating bikes, it's kind of the same thing, but for cars. And so Mercedes and BMW used to have their own service, but now those went away. And now there is this new service uh, called Gig Car. And it's for, it's by, um, AAA, so if you're a AAA member, you actually get 10% off. Um, so they're usually, I think they're all just Prius hybrids, which I've never driven a Prius before. Not mad about it, but it was a little bit nicer driving around like a Mercedes or BMW car. So that's that. Um, we're gonna be using that. I'll show you guys the car in a sec, but we're trying to get ready first so we can leave and. So we can leave in like, I think we're leaving like 20 minutes or so. So, gonna do that. Let's get it. Let's see the car. Blah. All right, y'all. Ready? Got the stuff in my backpack. Someone's tying their shoes. Don't they remember how. I'm gonna toss these on. Go see Hawks. And we're ready to go. Ready? Yeah, we're gonna do our checklist. Okay, let's go. What do you need? <laughs> what do we need? Let's go. Here it is. It's a nice 
nice drive. Uh, one thing that's kind of weird, I've never driven a Prius before. The drive is really nice. It's nice driving a car that like has really good acceleration. My uh, parents' Honda CRV, which is what I usually drive, is super old, like a 2009 car, and it just cannot accelerate whatsoever. Um, so that's nice. Uh, another thing is if you look at the back, it's like locked. Like I don't know how people drive this because like when I look at the rear view mirror, that ish is blocked, bro. Like how? I don't know. But anyways, so we're driving uh, north on I-5 and we had you guys when we reached the parking lot. Alright y'all, made it to the Samish Lodge lookout. This is like where the parking lot is. And so it's a really nice view though. Keep it parked. You can see a little bit of a view there. Through the freaking clouds over there. Dirty window. But pretty nice. Um so this is supposed to be like eight mile hike total but because we drove up to this spot, it's now like six miles round trip instead. So, should be a little bit easier. We're trying to get down so we can have lunch um, before things get crowded. So, yeah. Uh, I took a nice dookie, which is nice. Don't you say that. Always, always make sure you know your bowels and you pre prepare yourself. Do not say like, that. Like I always have to take a poop before I um, like leave the house or whatever. So I'm glad they had a nice little outhouse over there <laughs> so that I can, so I can do that. <laughs> I'm just talking to myself. <laughs> Oops. What just happened? We made it, y'all. Beautiful views out here. Look at all the greenery. The crew. Not too bad of a hike. It took us an hour to get up here. But we made it. Top of the top of the world. And now it's time to go back down. I think we're going somewhere in this area. Gonna go get some oysters, fill our bellies with some raw seafood. Let's get it. Yeah, finished. 
finished the hike. I know you saw the cool little view over there. There were, that wasn't that bad of a hike, especially compared to the one we went on last week. Um, the, as we were walking down, there were a ton of people coming back. Uh, and when we got to the parking lot, like there were cars lined up down the, down the road. But overall, good hike, nice and easy. The trail is a little slippery, but that might just be because it rained uh, last night, so it's still a little wet, a little damp, moist. Um, so now, we are going to Taylor Shellfish. Uh, it's like their farm over here in Bow, Washington. I'm gonna get some fresh oysters straight from the, wherever ocean. they come from. The ocean, the lake, the water. Oh, yeah. All right, little bumpy roads coming out of the place. at Taylor Shellfish to be specific. Got some oysters. I got a whole bunch of ones. I'll put the names of them right here. Uh, but I got like all the different kinds. I like variety. We got some potato salad. Mm -hmm. uh, too cold for my face. Uh, some ceviche. Some marinated octopus. I got myself a little Pilsner vibe. But we yeah, are here. Got a nice little view. You see the vibe. We yeah, are here. Are you excited? You like it? Quite literally, a farm to table. Or what they say, something to table. Ocean? Yeah, it's fresh. They literally cut right here. Alright, y'all. We packed some to go or grab some from the little market. Going back. Was it good? Yeah. Oh, that's good. Yeah. So, about to bring some back for the fam. And we'll be heading to... Funko. Funko. 